Good evening, everybody. I'm Mary Love, and welcome to Country Living. Welcome to my kitchen. I've been down for a few days, so I really haven't been doing a whole lot. It's been a couple of days since I've done a video, so I figured I'd get in here and make some cookies tonight that I can put in the freezer after they're done and everything and have them for our Christmas party. I'm going to make a sweet and salty Christmas cookie. So, let's get down here and get some stuff put in this bowl and get it mixed up. I've got one stick of unsalted butter that I softened a little bit in the microwave. All right, we got a stick of butter in there, a fourth of a cup of white sugar, and one cup of brown sugar. We're going to mash this up with a fork. Hopefully this butter is softened enough to do that. Probably should have got a bigger bowl. I'd have been a little easier to mix up. This is going to take a little bit, but I think if you mixed it with a hand mixer, I think the butter gets too soft and it makes the cookies too soft. This mixed up. All right. Next, we're going to add one egg and one teaspoon of vanilla. All right, we got that mixed up. So one egg, one teaspoon of vanilla. Mix that up. There's the oven preheated to 350 degrees. All right. Now we're going to add in one and a half cups of flour, all purpose flour, a half a teaspoon of coarse salt. Half a teaspoon of baking soda. We're going to mix this up. Try not to make a mess. Uh, spilling flour everywhere like I would if I used my mixer. Somewhere I've got a blending fork. Let me see if I can find it. Okay, now we're going to add in um, a half a cup of white chocolate chips, a half a cup of red and green. Now I'm using the mini M&Ms because that's what I had. 
But the red and green M&Ms. Well, I guess that wasn't completely dry in there. A fourth of a cup of crushed pretzels. And now we're going to add in a half a cup of crushed potato chips. Half a cup of crushed potato chips. So now we're going to mix this in. And there you have sweet and salty. And it takes a minute to get this mixed up, but once it is, I think these are going to be some really good cookies. Alrighty. Now then, we got everything mixed in. To get my cookie scoop and grab a cookie pan. And we're going to mix these about a tablespoon into a little ball like that. And we're going to put them on the cookie sheet a couple inches apart. And this, then we're going to bake these for about nine minutes or until the edges start to turn a golden brown. So I'm going to get these on this cookie sheet and then we'll be back. So y'all stick around. All right. Here's the first pan going in the oven. Nine minutes and then we'll be back. So y'all stick around. Okay, the cookies are done. Uh, let's see. Aren't they pretty? Red and green and white. They're pretty. That's good. Can't really taste the potato chips. Mm. Those are good. These are a keeper. I'll put the recipe in the description box below. And then y'all can give them a try. And I'm hoping that they freeze well. I think they will. Hmm. But that's my video for tonight. Sweet and salty Christmas cookies. If you're new to my channel and you haven't yet subscribed, I sincerely hope that by the end of this video that you will consider doing so. To all of my newcomers, thank you so much for joining my family. I deeply appreciate it. I've been sharing a lot of Christmas candies and different kinds of cookies and stuff for Christmas. They make good, great Christmas presents. So I wanted to share them early enough so that 
if you wanted to try any of them, you'd have time to make some. So, but with that, I will say good night, God bless, and until we meet here again, y'all have a wonderful evening. And like I said, the recipe will be in the description box, and I hope you'll give these a try. But God bless.